Hi Pisces, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to another Love Bite. Pisces, let's see what message wants to show through for you today. And of course, these are general collective readings, Pisces, will not resonate with all of you. Please keep that in mind. Take what works for you and leave the rest. So let's begin. Welcome back all my subscribers. Thank you, thank you for being here. And Pisces, if you're new here, we welcome you as well. Do join us, subscribe to the channel, become part of us. We welcome you in. All right, Pisces, center of my spread, I have the Four of Pentacles. Okay, somebody holding back yet or they feel you're holding back, I don't know. Okay, bottom of my deck, the Fool card. Somebody does want to take a risk here, Pisces. Somebody does want a brand new beginning. But uh, I think there's been some kind of conflict between the two of you. Maybe one person is feeling conflicted in their own mind. I don't know because they never put the work in. Now they feel like all these mind games I was playing. I feel like a loser. And the more they think about it, the more it overwhelms this person. The more they feel burdened. And uh, well, there is a sense of a little bit of holding back, depression, feeling, you know, all my secrets are revealed, very stressed out about that. Uh, let's see, let's see, uh, Pisces, I'm going to start with some dialogue message cards. Let's see if you guys could say something to each other, what that would be, and then we'll clarify these cards, okay? So, Pisces and their person spirit, if they could say something to each other now, what would that be? Pisces and their person. Maybe they want to come and reveal some things, but that is stressing them out as well. How do I go and explain? Not figuring out how to start this conversation or... Again, I'm talking too much. We'll come to the cards when we come to them. Let's concentrate on the dialogue message cards first, Pisces. Let's see if you guys could say something to each other, what that would be. in Pisces, if any of you are looking for personal readings, my email is in the description box below. You can reach me there. So the first card here, Pisces says, I hate it when I communicate with you and you could keep the conversation going, but you shut it down. Can't you tell that I'm trying to get you to coerce it out of me? I want to tell you what's going on with me, but I can't just come out and say it. Damn. See, this is what I was feeling. Somebody wants to reveal, somebody wants to say whatever's on their mind, but they're very stressed out. They don't know how to articulate it. So they want their person to dig. They want the person to force it out of them or ask questions or push them to say something. This relationship seems more like a situationship right now. I feel like you're taking my love for granted. Yeah, it can't be one-sided, can it? Why do you hide your pain from me? You know that I can see right through you. Our souls are entwined and reflect each other deeply. If you would only talk with me, I could help support your healing and that, that would then heal, sorry, and that would help heal me too. One second, I don't know why I stuttered. I'm going to repeat this card, uh, Pisces. Why do you hide your pain from me? You know that I can see right through you. Our souls are entwined and reflect each other deeply. If you would only talk with me, I could help you I don't know again, I could help support your healing and this would help heal, heal me too. Oh my God, I don't know, second time. Maybe there is a little difficulty in opening up and talking because it's so difficult to ask for help. Maybe somebody finds it really difficult to ask for help that, hey, talk to me, I'll talk to you, we can heal each other. They're finding it very difficult to ask for help. Second time I tried and I got stuck on the same line of, hey, like, let me try this again. Okay, sorry, I'm laughing. Okay, laughing at my own self, don't worry about that, okay? If you would only talk with me, I could help support your healing and this would help heal me too. Got it right, finally. Yes, yeah, somebody wants... Uh, somebody wants to talk, they want the person to talk and because they want help. They want help. So they say, if I can help you, then I would get helped as well. I know that it's in our destiny to marry and have children together. We are to be united in mission to serve God's plan to spread love and light in this world. Our combined gifts are important to this world. I love you not only for your beauty but also for your soul. Our love will be alive forever because of the way you are. Pure, true, authentic, 
real, raw and passionate. See, I'm not getting stuck anywhere else. <laughs> Except when I read the card where somebody is saying, I need help. I want to help you so you can help me. I'm stuck in my pride and ego. See, this, is, this was the reason. This is the reason why somebody can't come forward and ask for help. I'm stuck in my pride and ego and feeling very frustrated and foolish. I know that my behavior has really disappointed you, but I'm even more annoyed with myself. This situation is so messy. I'm under so much stress. Yes, that, that I already saw. There's a lot of stress here. Okay, so Pisces, these were some of your messages. Let's start your reading. Let's start with an angel blessing card. Let's see what my angels have for you first, okay? As a blessing, guidance, advice or a message for Pisces. Emotions. Somebody is going through the dark night of the soul right now, Pisces. This could be you, this could be your cross watcher, I don't know. But this is a very, very emotional time for the two of you. As much as you guys may acknowledge it, not acknowledge it, maybe you're going through it separately. But this is uh, deep emotions, really, really deep, deep emotions here. So take care of that. Try and do things which uh, kind of get you out of really going too deep but it's not very good to go very deep into emotions also it's good to tap into emotions but not to a point where you go into the darkness okay so uh, spirit uh, five of wands what's the five of wands for uh, Pisces what happened here somebody wants to rebuild after a conflict maybe they want to open up now they want to come forward but there's been a bit of delay in uh, making up their mind but this whoever this person is uh, does really want to rebuild this tower which has fallen between the two of you uh, so then why is the eight of uh, pentacles in reverse then spirit if they want to rebuild they are gathering up the courage there's been so much of stagnancy no work has been put in things have become so slow so stagnant that somebody is trying to actually gather up their courage now to ask for this brand new beginning hey can we start again can i have a brand new beginning but uh, the problem here is they're feeling very foolish like that that card said in my pride and ego i'm feeling very foolish and frustrated with myself because all this while one person's been playing mind games or just wanting to have control or power or my way or the highway now they feel ah, ah, everything backfire on me i feel like the loser now so now they have to be the one to initiate or gather their courage to ask for this new beginning mm, let's see five uh, five of swords in reverse spirit five of swords yeah they they actually just want to sweep in they want to sweep in and uh, come back as an emperor now okay they are heavily thinking about all their foolish mistakes of the past maybe they were very rash or they were very immature at that time they could have done or certain things which were very immature maybe they never offered commitment and they drained this queen of cups out they lost the love of the, their life i mean this this is like queen of cups is unconditional love right maybe when they found this queen of cups they they were so interested in getting, 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 being very immature that they forgot that, hey, you know, I'm meeting, I'm, this is my queen of cups. This is the love of my life. I need to commit or do something. And the more they're thinking about the lack of commitment that they gave, the more this person is stressing out. I've got this card twice now, Pisces, for them. This person is in their head thinking about all that went wrong. But uh, they do want to come in now and be seen as somebody responsible. So this is like a huge burden on them, overwhelm, ten of wands, they are carrying a burden because now they want to come back. They feel I have made some foolish choices in my life, they have been thinking about this, they have been thinking about how to return back now. They are holding on very tightly to the hope I think. Uh, four of a pentacle spirit, yes, they are holding on very tight. They are stuck on this empress my believe it or not it may not be being seen in the 3d uh, realm but uh, energetically they are holding on very tight holding on to this hope of being back with their empress this person is wanting to come out of their depression now they've been sad for a very long time yes they want to communicate 
and uh, somehow somehow end this fight whatever conflict or argument or whatever you guys have been having in the past competition they want to talk and somehow end end this cycle of you know pain and fight and conflict between the two of you they want to reveal something what's this uh, uh, high priestess in reverse spirit what do they want to reveal one more one more oh my god i was waiting for this card okay so what this person wants to actually say is uh, hey you know i want to get out of my sleepless nights i want to get out of my stress i can't think or figure things out anymore i see my this empress in my future there are there are no other options there are no other options if i was confused before i'm not anymore i I choose one. I choose one, and all they want to say, all they want to uh, unburden is, "Hey, I love you." This person has a bit of difficulty, I think, in articulating their words, or they may hide their feelings. But this is what they really, really want to say. And then when they think of saying these words, they go right back into their mental trap of saying, "Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! What do I do?" And then they stop themselves from saying it. So, eight of swords for it. Eight of Swords. Eight of Swords. Yes, this person just goes right back into feeling sadness. They start going back into feeling, oh my God, what do I do? They somewhere stop themselves from taking this action, passionate action that they want to. When they think of the betrayal that they've caused their person by not offering or having lost out on a beautiful soulmate, soulmate connection. Maybe they disregarded their person or they mistreated their person, they hurt their person in the past. And uh, well, page of wands in reverse spirit, page of wands in reverse. They feel the only way to maybe now, okay, one more. They feel the only way they can get any kind of success with this empress is instead of words, if they can slow and steadily worm their way back into this empress's heart. Not just with words, not just with a message or a text, but if I, you know, slow and steady kind of work my way through in a very sneaky way. I, th I think this person doesn't know how to come right out and say it. Heart of hearts, what this person really wants is victory and they want a ten of cups with this empress. Okay, I think what they really want is a brand new beginning spirit. What? Why was the, uh, the full card, uh, the central, I mean, the overall energy of our reading today for Pisces? What's this full card? What's the full card? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Okay, see this is what I was trying to tell you. They they don't they till now I think haven't had the words to say what they wanted to do, wanted to say, but why the overall energy is the fool is my god, do they want to send this message? They really want to start this creative, passionate new beginning, new beginning, new beginning, and tell that person you're the one. You're the one who I see in my future. You're the one I want to commit to. You are the one who I want to have a rebirth of a connection. This could be a. This could have happened before, and they want to restart once again. Mm, well, they want to end the fight. That's for sure, so that you guys can have peace and harmony in your lives again together. Okay. So that was the overall energy of a person saying, "Hey, I want a new start." So they are fighting through their, you know, their own selves or going through their own emotions at the moment, feeling the heartbreak, feeling the pain that they've caused their person and uh, struggling to find a way back in. Mm, maybe they want their person to do the, some of the work or more, more of the work, but that's not going to happen from what I feel. They will have to gather up their courage. I do see them trying to pick themselves up, but going right back into retreat. But I don't think this person can stop themselves for any any more, any longer. Okay, so that's all I have for you, Pisces. This, but believe me, this person is trapped in their mind, in their emotions. This card came out two, three times. All they want is to get out of their head now, right? But for that, they have to take action. 
and the way they are planning to do it is by action more than words they want to slow and steadily in a very sneaky way worm their way back into this empress's life so that's all i have for you pisces till next time then love and light take care namaste